It's almost a century ago, 96 years to be exact, since copper was discovered at Cobar. And until 1919, these copper and gold workings were producing profitably. Then a fire closed production for 12 years. They've won a lot of gold and copper in the past, but it's been a stop and go industry. And since 1952, there have been no productive mines in the district. But Cobar hasn't given up hope, and in the past three years, there's been considerable drilling and ore testing. The results have been good, and the CSA mine is now back in production. Three and a half years ago, there was nothing here but scrub, and the dramatic development of this mine will cost about $18 million. Water has been a problem, but now it's piped from the Macquarie River through a pipeline 82 miles long. The copper ore is crushed after it's delivered from the shaft. Then from the grinding mill, the crushed material goes to flotation units where the concentrates are filtered from the coarser residue. The present estimate is for an output of 20,000 tonnes of copper a year, and that's worth about $16 million. The mine itself is one of the world's most modern, with electronic controls for greater efficiency. The present production rate is 5,000 tonnes of ore each week, soon to be increased to 7,500 tonnes. Wealth from below the ground to give new life to Cobar.